I want to add something. One of the questions, oh, yeah. the question you asked Jennifer, just very quickly, because I found it very okay. interesting. The question you asked her about: Are you worried about people working, you know, two different jobs? I heard that there's actually. I think the Wall Street Journal had an, an article on the fact that some of the people that were working from home, there's actually a website that shows you how to work two jobs. That's that's how much of, of an issue it's become for some people who are working wow. from home. That it showed them setting up two computers and how you can do four hours of work in one day and, and basically collect two paychecks. I mean, it's that's one of the, the obstacles that these companies do have with a total work from home environment. So it's yeah. kind of interesting that you asked that question. And the, um, sorry, but I, I need to share this really fast, Paul. There are companies, there are um, recruiting companies that are recruiting for remote employees only where you go to work. So let's say, Frankie, you were recruiting someone to work with Dennis and that you would be there for them eight to 10 hours available to only that one client. And they're, everybody's remote across the country. And I'm thinking, wow, I, I mean, a lot of people in, it's a gig economy. So what's different is, and this was pre-COVID, I mean, I don't see that working quite so well unless, I mean, it's kind of like the recruiter after the corporate recruiter kind of thing, um, but not everybody works well virtually. Right. I mean, it's very personal. Not everybody has that, can put those blinders on and ignore the, the washer and dryer, the dog barking. And not everybody has the space where they can focus let alone internet. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, there's so many things involved in it. 